Good day to you and welcome back to Medieval 2 Total War Kingdoms, the Britannia Campaign. Fred of Asgarnia here, and as you might remember in our last battle we li Command me. I thought that's a Captain Seaman. My god, but I am a filthy bastard. Last time we just whip whooped some English ass outside of Athen Rye. We've broken them they've broken their main field army. And once we defeat this Captain Su you in battle. Jesus, the remnants of that last army we crushed. This just increases command rating. Clear victory. Although we lost more men than we lost last time. Wipe them out. Oh, cool. Oh, he feels respected. Where's the fight? Okay. Right, this turn, this turn, now we march on Athen Rai. Athen Rai will be ours. See if you can kill him. No, we lost our assassin. Of course. Well, it was worth trying. Wow, you're talking from beyond the grave. Forgive me while well, I'm impressed. Okay, right now our economy is seriously suffering. As soon as we take Athen Rai, we'll sack the place. That should give us enough money to develop cork. And then maybe we can do some stuff with Tipperary. Hopefully. Okay, so now this is it. Athen Rai. That said, we're really going to need to seize control of the seas. We're going to need to seize control of the seas, mind you. Oh good, we have enough money now. We can do, we can upgrade Cork, our capital. And I think in Tipperary, a market wouldn't go amiss. No! Attack! We shall slaughter them, sire. Jesus! Let it be known that Brian killed Brian. But what have they got in there? Oh. I don't see why the odds are so heavily stacked against us. This is unnerving. This is actually a bit unnerving. I thought our army would be more than powerful enough. Alright, we'll have to fight this one out then. Okay, and that's Hugh Cressingham, who I looked it up actually afterwards. Apparently he was a, um... He was the treasurer of Scotland appointed by the English king. And I think when William Wallace revolted, he was shot to bits. He was pulled to pieces, as it says here. They flayed him and divided pieces of his skin between them. One thing, though, about William Wallace. You saw he had half his face, his face painted. That fashion went out of, out of date in there about 5,000 years earlier. Inaccuracies. It is riddled with them. I don't know why the odds are so heavily against us. Normally, you know, we'd be... The odds would be quite favorable. Shut up, you. Jesus, you're the last thing I need. We lost a regiment of catapults. Well, this is lovely. Alright. Alright, I want my crack infantry to be first into the breach. Crack soldiers. Trouble is, they're not going to run. They're going to fight to the death. That's what's probably going to make this so arduous. That's what's going to make this fight so arduous. We've routed them before. We haven't totally destroyed a regiment. Blow that gate open. Now, this is a trebuchet. As you can see, it operates on a counterweight. What would happen is you'd have rocks loaded into the sling. A weight would be put inside this um, inside this uh, piece here, this piece of wood. It'd be hauled down by this lever. Then, once the the catch was released, that would pull, that would drop down, firing the thing, the the rock into the wall. Simple. Using physics for military advantage. Looks pathetic, really, doesn't it? We'll blow these walls open. Actually, don't bother with the gate. Focus on the wall. Everybody, focus on the one wall. 
I'll probably do what I did last time and cut the recording until the walls fall down. It's, uh, it seems like the most reasonable thing to do. Because I'm sure as much as you lo all of you love seeing things getting blown to bits, you know, I'm sure you'd rather see something a little bit more satisfying. Like men chopping the balls off each other and castrating each other. Come on. Don't dilly and don't dally. That's it, lads. Hope that I hope this stuff bloody does damage. I'm gonna cut the recording. I'll be back when we've actually blown the walls open. So, be right back. I've never known a wall to take so long to collapse. And even then, it's not fully down. It's only halfway there. Blah. Timber! Finally! Took you long enough. And it seems the, the meter's actually gone up substantially in our favor. Let's see what you can do about those towers. I don't want to take too many casualties just trying to get in through the front door. Right. You lads will spearhead the attack. Let's get them, lads! You cease fire. You're no good to me. Any luck? Oh, Jesus. That was pretty good. Come on! Let's teach them a lesson! Send up the other lads behind them. Normally I'd make two breaches, but... I want to get this done quickly. Oh, this is going to be bloody. Very bloody. Yep, yeah, here we go. This is where we start taking casualties. These things. Towers. They're a colossal pain in the neck. Oh, this is just like at the beginning of the game, with the Welsh and the Irish charging at each other. See? Now oh, we're dying, and we're not even in the door yet. Alright, ceasefire, you've done your job. And done it well, I might add. Jesus! Don't! I'm on your side! And we're in! We're in! We're in, by God! We're in! Now these lads won't be a problem. Hope not, at least. Shaken already? You haven't seen anything. Wait till we get our Ulster Swordsman in here. Jesus, they still haven't taken a casualty. What? How the hell does that work? Victory! How could that possibly be possible? Come on, break. And here come the rest of them, our Ostman. I tell you, if we get... And now the Galaglia can enter the battle. Ah, oh, we can win this battle if we can break... Th if we can get into the breach. Oh, the militia are run the peasants are running. That might spread panic, with any luck. Yep, Spear Militia are rousing. Which the Galaglia might do the same now, just out of panic. That's it, lads. That's it. Yep, Galaglia are in trouble. We're in! We're in! Don't mind them. Come on. Keep going. Although they still have a lot of men in the center, which is probably going to cause us problems. Don't dilly. Don't dally. Here, we'll send the, we'll send the cavalry in. Might be able to get them to go around the back door or something. Done it before. Might work. No point sending in the, um, the rear door. There's just too few of them. Four men aren't going to win us the battle. Come on. Don't dilly. Jesus, they're brave bastards. I'll give them that. Well, they won't stand. By the living God, I hope they don't. Just thinking about it. 
victory seems certain. Is this a lie I see before me? <laughs> Macbeth. Alright, come on, the rest of you. Let's teach these buggers a lesson. They're not going to stand long. Do 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 do. The Lord is with us today. We have we captured. Have good tidings. Oh, we've the killed the general. general lies dead. We have sent the cart to hell. We have sent the cart to hell. All right, now these are the men. It's these these lads are going to cause us problems. And these lads also will fight to the death. So this isn't going to be an easy fight. It's going to be quite the opposite, actually. going to be a bloody bastard. But so far the men have done their duty. It is all I expect of them. That's it, just that's it, that's it. Viking blood, you know. This is probably where they're gonna break us actually. If we could lose anywhere it might be here. What the? What the devil? What are you doing? Jesus! I didn't even see that. This while they have their backs turned. Nope, they caught us with a trout. With oh dear. So the men are going to fight to the death, which means it kind of limits our chance of victory. Okay, get them, get them out of there. Car cavalry are no good in the city. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. And if any of our men run, it could start a panic that could set the whole lot in retreat. And we don't need that. Oh, nice one! I saw what you did there. Clusterfuck. Jesus. Is, are you serious? They can do that? That's a disgrace. Jesus, we'll be lucky to win this one. And our men are exhausted, which doesn't help. Okay, I'm going to cut the recording. If we do well, I'll let you know. Would you look at that? Our entire army whipped. Not entirely. We're not totally beaten. Not yet. See if we can lure them outside. I don't know how many men they had left in there. But I don't expect any more of my men. Look! Billman, yeah, we can't win this. Yeah, we have uh, Ah Fortune spat on us today. We can only vow to atone for this defeat by crushing our enemy next we meet. We'll do is we'll load us and First time we've lost, actually. Hmm. Huh? Lift the siege, if you insist, sire. We may camp here, lads. Jesus, we got our asses handed to us. An enemy to crush. That was our strongest army, broken at the walls of Athenry. Right, we'll load, and what we'll do is... We'll load, and we will maintain the siege. Because... It's the walls that defeated us. If that had been the open field, I reckon we'd have won. Quite easily, actually. Right, but wait. Because the English can't really reinforce themselves, and if they do have them, if they're forced to attack us, I'm pretty sure we can win. But I was right. The Galagliac were the problem. The Galagliac... Ugh, it's just the walls killed us, actually. I'm gonna cut the recording here. I'll be back.